electric field due to an electric dipole at a point on the axial line here a point here plus a positive charge negative charge now the electric field in this point the direction radially outwards for positive charge radially inwards for negative charge the distance uh, between the origin and the charge a uh, the distance between this point and the origin is take its r it represents the vector the direction of the electric field the electric field at a point p due to the positive charge therefore the electric field so due to this positive charge we write it as e plus equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught q by r square the distance between the point and the positive charge from this point to this point okay now this point to this point is r so we subtract this a so we write it as r minus a whole square so the direction the direction indicates positive direction so that is the p cap the electric field at a point p due to negative charge the electric field at a point due to the negative charge so now we can write e minus equal to 1 by 4 by epsilon naught q by so distance square so distance from this point to this point or, or plus a so r plus a whole square the direction indicates negative direction so minus So this value is negative direction so the total value will be became a negative so e equal to minus 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught q by r plus a all square p cap the total electric field at a point P is calculated using superposition principle of electric field. Therefore, total electric field is equal to the electric field at a point in positive charge plus the electric field at a point negative charge. So, E total equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught q by r minus a or square p cap minus 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught q by r plus a or square p cap we take the common value outside q by 4 pi epsilon naught bracket 1 by r minus a all square minus 1 by r plus a all square p cap into now take lcm cross multiplication and multiply in denominator total electric field q by 4 pi epsilon naught r plus a whole square minus r minus a whole square r minus a whole square into r plus a whole square p cap
we use the algebra formula. A plus B whole square equal to A square plus B square plus 2AB. A minus B whole square equal to A square B plus B square minus 2AB. A square minus B square equal to A plus B A minus B. So the R plus A square by this format R minus A whole square this format and R plus A or minus A by this algebra formula. Now let's continue. A equal to one four Q by four by X or not R square plus A square plus two R A minus R square plus A square minus 2 or A. Now, R plus A square. R square minus A square. So, already the square is there. So, and a square p cap positive is negative so you so negative it's getting positive or or cancel a a cancel so e equal to q by 4 pi x or not 4 or a by r square minus a square or square or is very 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 greater than a so we neglect a therefore q by 4 by x star naught 4 or a by r square or square okay. equal to q by 4 by x star naught 4 or a by r power 4 so cancel it became R cube. So therefore, total electric field Q by 4 by X naught 4 A by R cube. So R R cancel R power 4 R cube. Where electric dipole momentum P is equal to 2 Q A. Here 4 Q A is there. So write 2 P. Total equal to 2p by 4 pi x la naught by r q. So this is the total electric field of an electric dipole for a point on the axis.